Hello then, welcome back to some Crusader Kings free as the Kingdom of Finland. We are growing in strength, hopefully we can uh, gain more vassals eventually when these guys are willing to join over. Looks like they would be if they weren't at war. We just have to wait until they are actually available, but they would be powerful vassals underneath me. I don't know if I want such powerful people, if I want to co uh, conquer the land more directly and give it to members of my own family, I'm not sure. As for now though, we are invading this island here, it is the Barony of... Uh, Sund, Tribe of Sund. I know it's more as Eland, because I think that's what it's called. Anyway, let's uh, go ahead and split this army in half. Because we are going to be besieging some areas. Gonna lose 100 people if I do that. Oh well, we've got some men to lose. Let's go ahead and start going off here. Betrayal can I? I know. Send proposal? Um, yeah, matrilineal? No? Ah, so we're actually going to lose my sister Lovisa here. Let's uh, let's not do it then. Lovisa, I have a bit of prestige. We can break betrothal there. Let's get back to her. find her a suitable husband. Sort by matrilineal and prowess. Who do we have? Mosheg, a man who can fight. But he's forty-seven. Anybody a bit younger who can fight? Thirty-one. 26. He can fight and he's 26. You can fight and you're 27. Let's go with a uh, 26 year old. Incorrect religion, but oh well. Sure, he's now my brother in law and he'll be on the front lines. He'll also convert. So we got that going for us. Oh, they've actually decided not to uh, besiege that other bit of land there. Oh, let's move over some men and uh, begin the siege there as well. And hopefully we'll be able to uh, take care of all this land soon enough. We actually need our money though. Who are you? You are not my friend. Are you going to see? They are indeed going to see. And then over to the... Did they just pay money to go across this land? God damn it, AI, seriously? Seriously, are you paying money to do that? Right, I don't think I'm hostile to you, am I? The uh, house, the it's not the Isles, it's not the Africans, but there is a third. Yeah, it's none of them. But still, they're going to take my war score away. Oh, the Africans have actually arrived over here. Let's get our army together. And we're going to have to deal with somebody here, whether it's the Africans or the other chaps. we got quite the army. Let's go and destroy this force. Our friends should be on our side to come and... Nope, my friends did not care one bit. So that battle was a dis disaster for the enemy. We slaughtered them. Every single one dead, only losing 23 men. My goodness. Didn't lose any of their champions. Um, did my son kill anyone? Uh, Sampo killed two people in that. Right, let's, uh, let's allow these people to catch up and then we are going to go over to the rest of their forces. We don't even need to have them catch up. We got some great army here. We can probably destroy these fellows. Excellent, another battle one there. Another slaughter. Excellent. The young mediator. There was a commotion among the children today. Kat Sayo was attempting to preach among her fellow youngsters and became the target of a small fight. Hanpo intervened and managed to stop the fight before anyone got hurt. Uh, Hanpo becomes calm, brave. Sure, be brave, my son. Another slaughter, I'm sure. We lost nobody. Excellent. I doubt we're going to catch these uh, African gentlemen, but we will try our best. No, they're going to go to my mainland instead. To take this place will take six months. Them to take my capital five months. So we're going to go over and fight them. Because uh, them taking our capital would be an utter disaster. And we know how my capital stands against sieges. Not very well. It looks like we will catch them here and begin a battle. They are outnumbered. Most of their forces were stuck behind. They have some horsemen. But their horsemen are not going to do anything against my bowmen. We know how Agincourt went. We are historians. Excellent. What a grand battle. But hardly any war score gains. In fact, I lost a champion as well. Who died? Not my son, but Laurie. Lori, who uh, married my courtier here, he has died. Let's go and sort by prowess again. We need another guy to replace him. 
bleed out very fast. How does that work together? This man here's got hail though. Let's go ahead and pick him. He's a little bit worse, but probably only by one or two score points. Excellent. The army does need a new commander. However, let's go ahead and pick Piranha. Piranha the Piranha. Let's go. We need to uh, win a battle here if we can. No. Let's go and uh, re-seize their land here then, because this is where the war score is. And of course these chaps are going to take that back, are they? No, they have left. Well, good. I'm glad that you have decided to leave. Quite satisfied. Hanpo has been asking me for a rolling hoop for a long time. And I told him we would get one for him in three months if we displayed more focus in his studies. This again. Become content. Fickle. Trusting. Let's have him become content then. Sure. Loyalty or fear. As their king, my vassals owe me their allegiance. My word is law, but how much obedience worth without that. Generous liege. Yeah, let's become a generous liege. And let's siege back this land. I'm actually losing war score here. And another diplomacy perk. Uh, I don't go to war for my allies. What is this madness? Befriend. Close family opinion. Force. Fall opinion gain from gifts. Heart of the family. Sure. I also don't have any schemes going on at all. Should I be trying to uh, sway people here? Any of you not at war? You're not at war. Offer vassalage he would accept. Let's do it. That is a lot of land to secure through this man. Excellent. He has decided to join. Very, very strong vassal here. Hopefully we can see his land uh, break up upon his death. He only has the one son, however, looks like. Could we murder him? Could we... I can't revoke anything. We do have a lot of prestige though. I probably could just up this. Tribal rulers with non-tribal lieges may settle, becoming feudal or clan. Characters can be imprisoned. Let's let's rise the authority. We, or we could just go for even more bowmen. I mean, look at this. We could have another. Let's do it. Another load of bowmen. It is. Where are they over here? Yeah, we'll now have two thousand five hundred bowmen. This is going to be incredible. Let's see where these guys want to land and then we'll uh, chase after them, wherever it is. Back to Africa? Good. Oh, we actually have 100%. Let's uh, enforce some demands here. So be it. We're above our domain limits. We did have a great battle there. Excellent. Disband all of these forces, please. And let's see what we want to do. You don't give us any money, but you do give us levy. Not as many as uh, there. More than there. More than there. Let's see what uh, my sons are in line to inherit. Specifically, Lempo. Oh, he no longer has a uh, patrol there. He's 24. Let's sort by uh, inheritable traits, please. Quick, pretty, comely. Anything uh, really stands out? A load of candles, perhaps? Just a quick candle. Where's the. Aha! Genius, but she's 43. So, not the best. You there are quick. You are pretty. But quick is pretty good. It's not as good as what we had before. She's sadistic, cynical, temperate. So by age, let's see if there's many more options around. Maybe the uh, other screen here. Let's go with this. Relation all. Diplomatic range inside. Adults. Whatever. Gender, females, unmarried. Religion. So let's go sort by age. Let's have a look for genius. 18. She is 18 and a genius. Let's go ahead and try that. No, I can't. Why? Why can't I invite you to course? She just spouse or She's a concubine? Ah. Oh. oh, what a greedy wanker. What about the other one then? I'm not sure what it's called, but it's... Is it quick? No, I, I'm looking for the one with the free candles instead. Or was it straight to genius? I'm sure there was another one. Camely, no. I'm sure there was something. I'm sure it didn't go straight to genius. There was another one, wasn't there? 
Or well, let's instead look for a beauty. A bit old there. What about pretty then? Oh, handsome. Would be the one. This isn't any good. Oh, she's blind. Well, too bad. Let's just go with the original looking then. We'll just uh, go to our boy. Go for that. Inheritable traits. Already have. Very good. And quick might be the best option. So we're going to go ahead and pick her. She also actually gain him some prestige. So we got that going for us as well. Excellent. Being raided uh, above domain limits. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You there. Would she uh, convert? Yes, she would. Excellent. Now let's see what you are in line to inherit, Lempo. Because we could be giving you some of that land there. You, of course, uh, Lempo. Wait, what? Lempo? So Lempo's going to get that high lordship, despite not having any land? This is Lempo. Hanpo gets free. Hanpo... Wait, start from the top. So you, my son and heir, you get that, that, this and that. Very good. Lempo gets the high chieftain there, but no land underneath it. And then this Hanpo gains that, that and that. And then Chieftain Armpo gets the Chieftain of Arland. Why would Armpo get Arland when he already has all of this land here? That's madness. It's absolute madness. So I can't grant you a land. I can. Well, I'm going to give you a land. Great. As for you, though, can I grant you the, uh, the title there? No, it's right here. Uh, Savo. Is it the High Chieftain of Savo? Where he is? Let's have a look here. Just so I don't dung goof. Yeah, Savo. Let's grant him Savo. Very good. He's now the High Chief of Savo. Good man. What does he call his son? Lally. Why would you do that? Why would you call him Lally? Let's have a look at the uh, succession again. Oh, this has gone up a lot. Realm succession, so now you're in line to inherit just that one county. Han Po is after these two, and Len Po of Aeland is after that and that. Nonsense, why? Why would you do this to me? And I can't then grant you these other titles, can I? No. Can't do it. Well, that is ridiculous. You have, as a High Lord, are now not in the uh, line of succession. What titles down here, though? This is the High Chieftain of Poriana. Also, Corellia, are you at peace now? No, still can't get you over. Uh, are you over here? Are you at peace? Yes, do you want to join us? No, he does not. Do you want to have no choice? I am in debt. And a lot of debt at that. Ha. Huh. Minus two. Maybe I could sway this man on our side. Sway him over. Yes, let's try it. Can't send him a gift? Well, of course I can't. I don't have any bloody money. As for you, how close are we? Minus 23 now. No real chance there. But this man we could potentially get on our side. You there? You like me, but... Minus 15, not too great. Let's just try and get ourselves out of debt for now. Because we are in a lot of it. And you can ransom some Gorm for 25 gold. So that's something. Great deal. Annie Veritainen. Who is she? My sister. My sister Aini. Arnie? Arnie. Let's have a look and see what we can do with her. Matrilineal, of course. With Prowess being the man. Let's not go for that guy. Let's get a nice 22 year old husband. A toy boy. Excellent. You there. 22. Demand conversion. Excellent. Well done, chap. Empty council position. Let's go for a Chancellor. Chieftain Lempo. High Chieftain of Armpo. Um, this is Diplomacy, so we'll give that to you. Chieftain Pyre Marshall here, let's give that to High Chieftain Arampo instead. Oh, you, can we replace you with somebody else? She's probably much more, yeah, she is much more learned. We're going to give Pyvi this job. Excellent, then it's my queen, of course, managing domain. And these guys are all chieftains, of course. Lempo, are we sure there's not a High Lordship here? Arland is part of the High Lordship of Upland, I see. 
Well, let's just leave that where it is for now. Keep your eye on Corellia for if they are ever at peace and want to join in. Then you, of course, will have a look and see if we can do anything there. Anywhere I can get money? No, I can talk to a confidant. We will do just that. Ah, it's Parvely this time. Excellent. Goodbye, stress. I will not miss you. Lots of prestige gain, my god. Ow. Lots and lots of prestige gain. Look at that. 8.3 per month. What a what a man. We were smart to name him after a god, King Lempo. She about Sampo. She about all these sons. There's too many of them. Enpo, uh, can't plot to kill you again, I know. Disinherit, though, is an option. We could disinherit our boy here. He isn't... He just isn't very good. Lampo is very good at diplomacy. You're a mixed bag. You're not too good. You're just not very good at all. If I were to disinherit you... I would gain stress, he would gain disinherit. It would cost me a lot of prestige. And renown. Ooh. The family renown would go down. Alright. I will let you stay around for now. I'm just hoping you die on the battlefield. Could raise raiders. So I really want this land here. He's winning both his wars, so he's got that going for him. Court, prisoners, what have we got? We've got you, Gorm, Anson here. He can afford a ransom. Ten gold? Yeah, sure, let's do it. Could have uh, kept him, but there's no need for that. We should have plenty of knights at the moment, champions. I mean, yeah. High Chieftain Armpo. We're going to have our sons. We're going to have you forced, because I don't like you so much. We're going to force you as well. Lampo we're going to forbid, because he's good. You as well, my brother. But my other sons... They will be allowed to fight here. Let's have another look. Yeah, Sampo and Arto. Arto is my son. Hanpo, my son. He is allowed to fight. Uh, coming of age. Excellent, Hanpo. You grew up so fast and you, yeah, you're not great. So we should have you on the front line as well. My two sons who aren't great. That'll be Sanpo and Hanpo. Have them both forced onto the front line. Very good. But Lempo, Lempo can, uh, he can be off from the front line. There's no need for that. Armpo as well, I think. But he's already received his inheritance. He's not too fast. Betrothed can marry. That is Hanpo to Katarina. And she is, of course, genius, I accept. Boiling anger, say so you might be king, but you are a loathsome churl. Unprovoked anger from my wife. I would give as good as I guess. Doxy, whatever that means. Sansa really not like my wife here. We could divorce her. She lose opinion and I'll lose piety, but let's let's not worry about that. So many man at arms regiments, and they're all maxed out. What perfection. A grand army we have. Defeat any of these fools if I so wished. Just want them to be at peace. You there. Off Vassage, he will not accept. Very good, let's go for it. Excellent, another friend for me. Is this man here? Oh, you're actually part of that realm. You weren't that far away. Minus 14. Anyone else? No, it's just these guys who I'm really interested in. If we were to try and create the Empire Scandinavia, we would need 22 out of 92 Dijon Duchies. That's a lot of land. An awful lot of land, especially with these CBs as well. So I don't think that's what I'm going to be too interested in. A strong Finland, however, is a must. In debt, allowing thieves guilds. Terrible. Go on, Karelia, end that war. Was this to the charming King Lempo of Finland? I think it might be the best interest of our realms to arrange a meeting between our heirs, Sampo and Borega. Who are you? Ah, you're the lord of this land. 
Uh, perhaps we should get better acquainted instead. Yeah, sure. Let's become slightly more friends with this guy. The house of Sarpmi. We could try and sway him to our cause. I doubt it would work, but we'll start to scheme anyway. Because that is a lot of land for us to be taking over there. 78. You are at peace, but of course we can't offer it. We'll get out of debt soon and we will have a look at taking over that there man's land. For now though, everything seems to be going well. We have a great king here with Lempo. Majesty focus as usual. Wife there. No, I'm not a fan of my wife. Not a fan of my son either. Should send him straight to war. A scheme at court, my spy master come to me with a discovery. He was certain my champion Lagon is scheming against my courtier Oshmar. Lagon. He doesn't have any money. I'll not accuse Lagon. He's a great man on the battlefield. We'll keep him around. No one out of debt, please. And we are out of debt. And that means we can... doesn't mean, but it allows us to get this. Personal scheme success chance plus 25%. We'll go ahead and take that. And let's have a look at the potential war goals here. Oh, the High Chief of somewhere. Moku, the guy of that land there, actually has a claim on all of his land. 750 prestige is a lot. Chief to Milos's claims, can't do that. Subjugation, we cannot do. Invade Kingdom, we cannot do. Duchy, we could do. Forward the land over there, but I think we'd rather just press this man here's claims and take the whole lot. 750 prestige is what we want. It shouldn't be too hard at this rate. I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.